Hello and welcome to Piano Shack with me, Woody. I've been a user of Band in a Box for 20 years or so, so when PG Music asked me if I'd like to make a testimonial, I was happy to oblige. I'm old enough to remember using Band in a Box on the Atari ST in the early 90s, but I really got into it big time in the early 2000s when I was playing in a jazz group and wanted to practice and improve my jazz piano chops. And for this, Band in a Box was really invaluable. I was also using Play Along CDs at the same time. They did sound better than the MIDI in Band in a Box, but you weren't able to change the tempo, the instrumentation, or the key signature. I then took a bit of a break from playing piano, but revisited Band in a Box about a year ago. It's pretty astonishing what's happened in the 15 years or so since I've been gone. It's still a fantastic training tool and you can change the tempo and the key signature just like before. But now with these real styles, it does sound just as good as the play along CDs that I used to enjoy. For me then, the killer feature of Band in a Box in 2019 is the real styles played by actual musicians. You heard in the beginning of this video just how good they sound. Nowadays, I primarily use it as a training tool for my YouTube lessons and for my private students. I like to use it to create backing tracks, which makes practicing a lot more enjoyable and inspiring. I'm also really enjoying the Trading Fours feature where you can listen to a solo of a real artist and then use that to get ideas and licks for your own improvisations. It is a very deep, capable, and I have to admit, sometimes a little bit hard to use program, but you can get very good results just by knowing the basics. Once again then, thank you very much to PG Music for inviting me to make a testimonial. It's been quite an honour and a privilege. Thank you ever so much for watching. I'll see you again soon. Cheerio.